All right, so we're back with Fallout 4. Um, well, Dakatori here. Thank you very much for coming again. Um, if you're checking this on Twitch, I'll be streaming every single day, except for Sundays that most likely I'll be, uh, you know, family stuff. I'll, I'll be busy these days, but most of the days I'll be right here and uh, I will prepare full days gaming day by day, I swear. So, um, if you're checking this on YouTube, thank you very much for coming too. Really appreciate it. Leave a like if you like the content. If you don't, but let me know why, please, on the comments. It will be really nice. And uh, if you definitely like it, subscribe. There's much more coming, as you can see, every day, every single day. Okay, let's continue with this. Last time we um, finished... We are definitely part of the uh, Minutemen. We are definitely part of um, what's the name? The uh, uh, Railroad, and we joined the Brotherhood. So the only one we're missing. Oh, what the hell? Oh. The only one we're missing right now. I know you like me, my friend. Um, is uh... oh, you know what? You know, there's something. The only one missing is D D D. Um, I forgot the name. Can you wait for me here for a moment? Hey, where do you want? Wait there. Roger, holding position. Thank you. Uh, uh, uh the institute. It's a cleaner shot. So everything can be taken. I'll take it. What? Oh, that thing? Wait, can I? Well, this is different. I am not sure. I know this is part of a mode, uh, of a mod, but I'm not sure what for. Hmm. Concrete. I will take everything I can from here. Because most likely I'm gonna lose it. Nuclear material, that's great. Because definitely I will not. The fiberglass, ceramic, cloth. I don't know what is that. Oh yeah, you know what is that? Um, there, there are different things or different reasons why I am not staying with the Brotherhood this time. But most important thing right now is that I will help as much as I can. The Freak, I got the name. Uh, I don't know what's happening with me. Never forget, you are the eyes and the ears of the Brotherhood. If you see or hear anything suspicious, it is your duty to oh, the guys. We live in enemy territory now. Your vigilance is the difference. Okay. And death. Understood? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, this friend is driving me crazy. Got like three itches I can't even scratch. Perfect. We're gonna make some money with these people, uh, that's for sure. What did I get? Flare gun. Oh, pipe wrench? Okay. <laughs> we sell some stuff here. Damn ferals. Radiation has a twisted sense Proctor of Dr. Tegan. What brings you to me today? Let me see what you have. Got some choice weapons that just came in. Uh-huh. So give me 308. It's gonna be awesome. Oh, they are saying this now. I love it. 
Wait, what's my level? Eh? Gatling laser. So, wait a minute. I'm missing some uh, parts. Now I remember. I have right right leg, left arm. So, right leg, left. Uh, we, we need to take this one. And... Uh, Right arm. Shit, they don't have. Hmm. Oh, power armor frame. No, I I don't need four thousand for this. Man, you're crazy. Four AKMs. Combat rifle. I think I have the combat rifle already, but I will no the shotgun. No, I'm gonna keep that one. Flare gun. Uh, this thing. Remington. Tokarev. And 96 more. I think, yeah. I barely use these things. Let's leave it like that. I'll leave the rest. I, I wanna, I wanna get a uh, every single gun in the game. But I'm gonna check this up. Because there are too many things here. There are different duffel bags and stuff that I can get ammunition and guns from. Ceramic, steel, chalk, copper, copper, just for solvent, okay. Great. Duct tape. Glass. Sylvester Squad. Typewriter. Wait, I know there is one here somewhere. The design of this uh, airship is awesome. Wait, where is it? I know there is one here. I was totally sure that they they have one there. there. That hold. Thank you, sister. You know we wouldn't have to worry about them getting out if they weren't on the ship. Your concerns Same. are noted, scribe. Give Proctor Ingram my thanks for letting me borrow you. what this is experimental plants are for but I'll take it <laughs> no oh my god nice 
Oh shit, I have one. <laughs> oh, that isn't the one that I'm missing. Is the uh, right arm. Oh. Ah, alright. You're an inspiration to us all, Knight. You are proud. You didn't ask. I heard that Elder Maxon got that scar on his face from going one on one with a death claw. I'm being a one on one with a death claw. Yeah, dumb and ugly had a child. It'd be a super mutant. Mine. Oh, okay. Good, but I'm I'm not getting what I'm looking for. Let me know. Definitely a lot of stuff. Nothing I really are interested in. Okay. Mark's really strong. Expert. Thirty-eight. There we go. Nice. I don't know what is this. Let's open it up. <laughs> what? Okay, I think we're good. Do you know what a ten pound cockroach can do to a buoyancy regulator? I can guess. Don't be smart. You want to see the brother who just worship the brought down by a buck? All right, all right. Just don't tell Ingram, okay? Fine. See something in the distance. Oh, that thing. Okay. I think we're done. Let's get the heck out of here. I want to steal all of those power armors, really. But there is something that I definitely want to see uh, still, which is this one. Let me take this for a moment, guys. I place it right here. All right, we're good. I don't know what is that for, but it's mine now. Uh, nope. 
This is the one that they give me, right? Ones, I think. But but this one says required. Can't to pick this. Hmm. I remember what is that room for. Okay. How goes it? I think I got all of them, I think. Okay, there is one more behind this place. Damn it, right. Uh, well, we're not gonna do that yet. So, let's quickly go to Spectacle Island, yes. I think we're gonna need to modify something about this, because I am not getting more people and I'm getting really annoyed because of that. So what I will do is to remove that thing and create a new one. Oh wait a second, I think I know what's going on and it's my fault. Configuration mod here. Um, doo -doo -doo, which ones will be? Um, no. XDI, uh, no, this is not the one. Settlement, settlements, uh, I think it's this one. Defense, work per settle. I don't know, 30 each, I don't care. Uh, just adjust max NPCs by charisma of low sediment to leave. Nope. To zeros uh, by bed count. Uh, each day. Uh, they're sure it'll keep happiness up. Mm. All right. See what happens with that. So now, let's do remove this one first. And I will create another one is radio beacon this one right here now let's take a moment no I'm not I'm not gonna take the chance I think I'm gonna keep it here. Yeah, just stay here. Cause I'm gonna throw all my junk. Oh, wait a minute. I forgot to see that. Um, I 
atomic rollerball. What is this? Hmm. Oh. Burn. We have to use this soon. Wait, what? Overdue book. What is that thing? The one that I just took? Ah, here. Stencil. I'll figure out what it's out for. I was wondering I was moving, right? Now this. Mm, I'm gonna save this one, I think I will need it later. Get rid of the rest of the things I have here. Hey, I'm sure I have something you need. Yeah, money. Let's see what you have. Let me know what you'd like. Just junk. But a good one, though. Got a few. It is a good one, but it's okay. I think that's it. Oh. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. What's the one that I'm using for that? Uh, this one. Oh, we have two fragments then. That's it. Oh, well, we'll have two tire irons. Get one of this. And we have two freaking fat ones, so I can go and sell one. Excuse me. If you need a weapon, you've come to the right place. Yeah. Let's see what you've got. Let me know what you'd like. Um, this and this. Whoa, not even the half of it, okay. Yeah, 
Yeah, let's save the rest. Uh-huh. That was the ink spots with it's all over but the crying. Because that part I've never well it never stopped. When the song ended, ironically. With the crying. activity in uh, here here <laughs> in the Diamond City that you might want to know about. Yeah, that's it. I've heard, I mean it seems that, uh, Nick Valentine is looking into some uh, former residents of Diamond City. There was a house in, it was in uh, the West Stands and there was a guy and a kid living there and they didn't really bother anyone. But, well, I guess maybe there was something funny about the whole thing. And I mean weird funny, not haha -ha funny. No. I mean, I saw the guy, and he looked, uh, sort of scary. But, well, I don't really know much more than that. But, uh, I guess if you see that guy, or that kid that was living with him, you should tell Nick. Or the guards. Or maybe both. <laughs> Orange Colored Sky by Nat King Cole. You love this one, right? Oh my god. <laughs> I never heard that part. That's pretty nice. Alright, so um, let's take a look here real quick. We got. Oh no, no. I know exactly what we have to do. And let's get into it. We are going to help the. Um, we're gonna get some nukes. We're going to help this. Uh, brotherhood. By the way, I have to go here too. There is another one, another settlement that I can use real quick. I get a, uh, a few caps. It's some ammunition. Ah. <sighs> All right. Now that you've familiarized yourself with the Pridwin's crew, are you ready for your next assignment, brother? Yep. Yes, Elder. Good. Let's get right to it, then. Shall we? Take a look over there. That's Fort Strong. And it's infested with super mutants. Having those aberrations of nature close enough to smell is making me sick to my stomach. To make matters worse, they're sitting on top of a massive stockpile of fat man shells we could use in our campaign. I want you to head over there. Wipe out everything that moves, and secure that stockpile. Understood? Consider it done. Look, I realize you're eager to take the fight to the Institute, but it'll have to wait. The Brotherhood cannot allow those abominations to have a nuclear arsenal at their fingertips. It'll be a pleasure to exterminate that mutant filth. Now, we have a vertebrate on standby, fully armed and ready to depart. Use it to carry our message to Fort Strong and wipe those dirty mutants from the face of the earth. Dismissed. Okay, let's go. Don't care. Welcome aboard, Knight. Instruments are green, and we're cleared for relief. Good. It's so lover, but to cry. Whoa. 
Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I got here another one. Okay, I said that I need... Um, okay, we got the first one on science, by the way. Uh, let's get... Shit, now I forgot. God's sake. Anyway. Not resistant, active boy, resist, party boy. Inspirational, da -da -da, more damage, no. Uh, intimidation. Nothing else for the settlements, right? Uh, I don't think so. You've mastered the art of deal by answer press da -da -da. We're gonna get this later on. So, um, sneaking. Okay, let's get this one. Try to keep him in your sight. Oh, this is gonna be tough, now I think about it. Wait, let me get rid of the others too, because... As I said, it will be tough. Really. I would need to use my... Whoa! That's a perfect aiming, what the hell? done. I don't see any other. Yep. Imagine that a butcher. Holy crap. Oh, I imitated. You see, I knew. I knew it. Get out. To clear the head. Head. Got you. That's it. Where is it? Oh, I see it. Getting hungry too. All right. Oh, wait. Oh, wait a minute, we have another one here. Which one is? This one. Wow, okay. Hmm. I'll take it. Hand, hide, and meat. Give me this. That'll be, that'll be. Not here. What we got? Uh, all right. Not what I was expecting, but it's okay. There must be something significant in this area. Uh, didn't you hear?
watch your step. There's quite a bit of debris here. Hmm. A good look to the surroundings. I'll be finding interesting things because of the mobs and stuff. And only when I take a closer look, otherwise, I'll not find a thing. Got the other one too? Okay. Oh, nice. Automatically uses steam pack when hit. Whoa, okay. Stands. Good. This area seems to be in disarray. This place, okay. Judging from the amount nice. Perfect. It's safe to assume we're the first people to investigate this location. I'll look at that. Silver. This area has obviously been abandoned for quite some time. So, is it necessary to tell me then that? Thing? That's it. Oh. This area seems to be in disarray. Nice. Let's go take the elevator, which I don't remember what it is. Oh, 
there. There. because I have to go there again. Ooh, look at this. Psycho. Ooh, gotta be careful. There's a launcher here. I'll get fuck out. Bravo team. This is the one that I was talking about. Freaking mi mi missile launcher. I don't know why, but every time that I see a radio, I feel the to activate it. find something here but I don't know what or where maybe I'm confused That's it. Yep. Now we need to talk with Dance, right? Yep. So I think you're gonna leave me alone or something like that? I don't remember what. Oh, this other one. Paladin, look at this place. You must hate these mutants as much as I do. <laughs> Why do you hate super mutants so much? Hate's too gentle a word. These monstrosities are just another example of man blindly taking a step forward 
only to wind up stumbling two steps back. I've been fighting for years, trying to put a stop to this madness. And just when I thought we were getting the upper hand, along come the synths. I've seen what these super mutants do to people. Can you imagine what the synths would do to us if they ever got the upper hand? It would be Armageddon repeated. And maybe the end of everything that we hold dear. <sighs> Look, I don't mean to bore you with my rhetoric. I just want you to understand how important these missions are. Yeah, I can tell that is not boring. Don't apologize. It reminds me why I'm doing this. Thank you, brother. It's good to know you're taking my advice to heart. Anyway, that's enough of that. What's important here is that you got the job done and secured these warheads. You should head back up to the Pridwin and talk to Maxon. I'm sure he'll want to debrief you as soon as possible. Dismissed. Is not over for the starting. Um, okay, before I go, let me check this out real quick. I think I remember I can find something up here. No. Okay, well. Let's go back to the pit when... Okay, let's sell this stuff, organize my inventory, and we are going to the combat zone. I've never been on the combat zone. I want to leave the experience and I want to get the follower that is there. After that, I think we're going to pay a visit to... Um, I think it's the 88. Elder Maxon. Outstanding work at Fort Strong, soldier. It was an honor fighting for the Brotherhood. I'm glad you feel that way. Because our mission here has only just begun. In order to bring the Institute to its knees, we need to use every weapon at our disposal. I try to supply my soldiers with the best. That's why I'm giving you these. Signal grenades can call a vertebrate to your location when you need aerial transport. Simply throw one to the ground. And the vertebrate will hone in on the unique electromagnetic smoke it emits. Once you're aboard, use the map on your pit boy to interface with the pilot's navigation system, so he'll be able to take you wherever you need. Thank you, Elder. I'll make good use of them. I expect that you will. Now, I'm sure you're aware that Fort Strong was simply the first step towards the liberation of the Commonwealth. An even greater task lies ahead. By now, I'm sure you've deduced that our arrival in the Commonwealth wasn't coincidental. We're... Excuse me, Elder Maxon. By now, I'm sure you've deduced that our arrival in the Commonwealth wasn't coincidental. We're here because of a unique energy reading recorded by Paladin, <sighs> according to our scribes. The reading indicated a level of technology that only the Institute could achieve. The moment this information came to light, our mission became clear. The <laughs> Institute and everyone responsible for the creation of the synths must be eliminated at all costs. To accomplish this goal, we need to locate the Institute's headquarters. I've had our scribes meticulously searching the Commonwealth, but they've come up empty-handed. Uh... Anything you need, Elder, you just say the word. I want you to get out there and become our eyes and ears on the ground. You seem to have a vested interest in locating the Institute before we met, so I'm confident you'll travel in the right circles. If you discover a way in, I need you to report it to me immediately. Any questions, Knight? No. Not right now, Elder. Very well, then. Dismissed. Okay. There is, there is, there is, now I remember there is one more thing related with uh, the railroad. Um, should we there right now? Should 
hundred, yeah. Well, not necessarily. Wait a minute. Where's the combat zone again? I don't remember. I think he's here somewhere. Ah, oh, here. Hmm. Show me another power arm. That's right, it looks really nice from here. I mean talking about the pit one. Most folks are just looking for a hand. All we gotta do is offer. Hey, Piper. Head my way? No, let's trade. Let's trade. This is what I've got. Um This one is 14. Grand spawn stress. Da da da. Right. Well, let's give her the one that I got. This one? And she has... This is right arm. Oh, okay. Anything else? Nope. Nope, that'll do it. Looks better. I just need to fix something else. The right leg. Huh? Just wanted to trade a few things. Go ahead. Can we trade a few things? Of course. Wait, what are you, what are you guys doing here? Oh, okay. I just oh. want to trade a few things. Wait a minute, you don't even have a gun. Uh, sixty-two twenty-five. Thank you. It's like I can finally think straight. Wait, a gun on you? Okay. Sounds good to me. Well, I'm glad I helped someone, really. I mean, I saw that guy there too many times. Fuck. So combat shotgun. Combat shotgun, I have one here. Uh, this one, of course, I have it right there. Sniper rifle. Um, let's switch this. A1, A3. I don't know what the difference is. Oh, I know what the difference is. Let's get this one then. Mm, above the rest, they're gonna leave some here. This, this, this.
Is that it? Yep. All right, I have no freaking clue about what I need to do there. Exactly. So, let's see what happens. Go to combat zone. We found out. <sighs> oh, Grandpa plays the numbers. I have no idea. Supposed to be in here. Wait, what? Yeah, um, is that the idea? That one was ugly anyway. Ouch. Raiders come. You're a regular artist. Well, I thought maybe trouble not anymore at least oh just peek your head up damn coward the heck with that i'm too pretty to go out like this hey you all done killing each other you finished tearing the place up now is it over well that could have gone worse <laughs> I don't know. Seemed quite the performance from where I was standing. Are you fucking high or something? Why am I asking? Of course you are. Was still winning the fight, wasn't I? You're strung out and getting sloppy is what you are. Of course, I suppose you ain't got to worry about that now. Seems this one just put us out of business. I'm not sure if I should kiss you or have my little bird here feed you your own entrails. I told you to quit calling me that. Uh, it just seems like you guys might be in trouble. Save your lives, you'll be grateful. What is this? What is this place? Not from around here, huh? This is the combat zone. Finest arena in the Commonwealth. Kate, here's the headline. A hundred plus matches undefeated. We used to serve a more legit clientele. But about two years ago, a gang of raiders rolled in and we became a more exclusive establishment up until you took our entire client base out of the gene pool and put us out of business that is i'm sorry it just seemed like you guys might be in trouble trouble nah 
But keeping those idiots entertained was what kept the lights on. Not exactly sure what we're gonna do now. To hell with them. More will come. Just need a quick breather and I'll be ready to go. A breather? What? So you can slam more of that junk into your arm? No, no. You know what? I think this was a blessing in disguise. You caught the end of that bout. What'd you think of Kate's work? Mm. Why do you ask? Consider it professional curiosity. Now, what'd you think of the fight? She's clearly talented. See? At least someone knows skill when they see it. It ain't your fighting skills I'm concerned with. So here's my predicament. I suddenly got no audience. No audience means I got no caps coming in. And if you ain't bringing in caps, little bird, you ain't an asset. You're a liability to me and to yourself. So, here's what I'm thinking. What say I let you take over her contract? She goes with you, watches your back. Look, you'd be doing me a favor while I try to get the place back in order. What do you say? Me? And him? But wouldn't you want her to go with me? Why would you want her to go with me? Yeah, Tommy. Her just head. why the hell are you trying to get rid of me? Maybe I just think you deserve some time off. Maybe I like this one's face. I don't know. I usually got a good sense about this sort of thing. So what do you say? Well, let's see. I'd like to know what Kate thinks. Don't I get a say in all this? That ain't how a contract works. Besides, you really want to stay here? No audience. No caps. No one to talk to, but yours truly. Jesus. Point taken. Atta girl. So, she's on board. Now what about you? Alright, let's see. Sure. I could use someone watching my back. Good. It's settled then. And here, take this. It's the purse from the last fight. Exterminator's fee. Now just wait a second. What exactly are you gonna do without me here? You don't need to worry about me. I'll get this place set up right. Maybe find a less blood-soaked clientele. Now get the hell out of here. You ain't welcome anymore, little bird. You're a real son of a bitch. You know that, Tommy? You don't have to tell me. I guess you just come find me then when you want to head out. Kate. So, you're ready to head out? Yeah, ready. About time I got out of this place. Let's go. Now, my question is, can I get rid of that motherfucker? Let me know if you find some spare ammo. Uh, let's see if I can find something else here. Ooh, yeah. Life preserver. I always get confused with that one. She had steer. for that matter Getting oh you will help me you definitely will help me come in hey what you need now you want something interesting and I will give you something interesting so take this and some ammunition Oh, Heads up. Okay. Point out what you need and I'll there get on it. Well, that was quicker than I thought. Mm. 
Tommy's rule, no fight outside the cage. No gaps, no entry. No begin, no lottery. No begging. Wait, I wanna know. I just wanna know what happened with these two. I'm inside of this thing. Yeah, that's weird. Security is too good. Nah. I'm quite confused. All right, let's do it this way. What? Oh, shit, right. Let's get it from here. There we go. Is it really? Hacking this is beyond me. Wait, what? Okay, a lock terminal. Finally. And TCL. Oh shit. Alright. Let's see what's going on with these guys. Heads up. Yeah. Lock tight. I think you can unlock that. I'm out of bobby pins. Have any on you? Look alive. Yep. Ah, uh, bobby pins. Where are they? Sure, sure. Just keep your shirt on. Look alive. What is it? See what you can do. Will do. Bed. Bed door. Wait, are you serious? There we go. Finally. Excuse me. Buzz off. Uh, <clears throat> guess they'll let anyone in here now, won't they? Go back. I thought that maybe it was something something important and release him or something, but nope, they're just there. See ya. Okay, we got this one. Um, let's, send, let's send her hey. straight Need there. Something? Wait there. Oh, Leaving shit. me behind. Come on. Yeah. It's about time for you to go, Kate. I'll head out, but I'm not gonna lie to you and say I'm happy about it. If you change your mind, you know where to find me. Of course. We'll be with you soon, anyway. Uh, now, if I am not wrong, the next follower is on the 88. So I need to go to the... Um, here, Vault 88. Vault 88 emergency classification. Unspecified integrity breach warning. 
Any available vault -Tec personnel are required to respond under Emergency Protocol VT-76. This signal will repeat. So that is... Where is 88? Let me make sure that this is the one. Just a moment.
So Curry. Oh, it's not 88, it's 81. Shit. Right, 88 is the other one. It's the one for the with the goals. Goals, I guess. So in that case. We need to go to... Here. Scavengers camp. Go southeast. Fuck is shooting. Keep your eyes open. I think this asshole's using a stealth force. Oh, I see. Now, where is the setup? There. <clears throat> Didn't expect help from a stranger. Thanks. Glad to help. You're one of the good guys. You wouldn't happen to know of any places to settle around here, would you? Mm -hmm. Tired of always being on the run. I sure do. Thanks. See you there in a day or two. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. I almost kill him.
increased size of sweet spot while kicking locks. Picking. Mm, okay. Oh, damn it, there were more? Am I fucked up? Sorry. So, I have to go southeast. Oh, by the way, I need to take this off. Oh, I see the, the, the gear from here. Nice. Oh shit. Fuck. Damn, okay. Volt 81. dead Hold it right there. Vault 81 security. I don't know where you got your hands on a working pit boy, but you better start talking. Um. I got it in Vault 111. Vault 111? Haven't heard of that one yet. And what sort of business are you looking to take care of here in 81? Just a traveler. I thought I'd take a look around. Is that so? And you expect me to believe that? Oh, overseer. Who is it, Edwards? Ma'am, some new Commonwealth traveler. Not one of our usual traders. Well, if someone wants in, they can earn it like everyone else. Let me speak to them. Sorry about that. Officer Edwards here was just doing his job. I'm sure you can understand our need for caution. For newcomers, we like to operate on exchange. You help us, we help you. Okay. Um. <coughs> but I'm a fellow vault dweller. <coughs> Why don't you just let me in? All the more reason to help out a fellow vault then. Right, well. I'm interested. What is it you need? Fusion cores. Three, to be exact. You get the fusion cores, we grant the access. Hmm. Huh? I already have the fusion cores you need. Really? Well then, I suppose I should say, welcome. I'll be down to meet you at the entrance.
Mm. Maybe exactly the same. Come on, Gwen. My guys have been working doubles for weeks now. They need a break. Everyone's working hard right now, Cal. You think I don't know that? Just do the best with what you can. That's all I'm asking. Fine. I'll see what I can do. But you and I both know we can't keep going on like this. Sorry about that. As you'll soon see, we have a few maintenance projects underway. Gwen McNamara, Overseer. Welcome to Vault 81. Here, we pride ourselves on having maintained a successful vault over these past two centuries. We'd like to be completely self-sufficient, but there are certain resources we can't provide ourselves. Hmm? I'm impressed you maintained a successful vault for so long. Thanks. I owe it to the Overseers before me, but some here would disagree. A few believe opening the doors to the Commonwealth was a mistake. Mm, well... You should be wary. The Commonwealth is a dangerous place. Exactly why we rely on a select few traders for our needs. That's why I like to use a give-and-take system. If outsiders are willing to help us, we're willing to help them. Speaking of, if you're ready, I can take those fusion cores from you. Sure. Of course. Here they are. Thank you. Dr. Penske will greatly appreciate these. Now, I have work to do. Most everyone here is very friendly with Commonwealth visitors. Although, that power armor may make a few people nervous. If you need anything else, I'll be in my office. Don't go feeling all special because the Overseer lets you in here. You weren't the first, and certainly won't be the last. Want to say something else? Hey. Another outsider? What they let you in for? Just taking a look around. Is the overseer just letting anyone in these days? Back off. <laughs> what do you have against outsiders? All outsiders do is take advantage of you. They're nothing but selfish animals. How do you know? Did something happen? Yeah, you could say that. I met a girl from the outside. Said she was going to take me away from all this. I gave her all my money so she could find us a place to live out there. I don't hear from her in months till a passing trader mentioned she saw her with some man in Diamond City. You outsiders are nothing but liars. Only looking out for yourselves. <laughs> I'm gonna take care of it. So, we got a new visitor today. Don't say anything, but man, I'd love to be out there. Mm. It's pretty dangerous. You wouldn't last a day. Yeah, that's the fear. At least with the way the Overseer has us working, 81 will still be around for a while. Why the long hours? We're just making sure this roof over our heads doesn't cave in on us. They say it's all the moving parts that have us working around the clock these days. Structurally, I guess 81 is still pretty sound. Vault Tech sure knew what they were doing when they set these places up. Well, I don't want to keep you, and I gotta get back to work. Maybe I'll see you around. The fuck? No signs of radiation. Impressive. Excuse me. Yeah? Watch out for the maintenance. It never ends around here. Hey, Ashes. What are you doing up here? Ashes, <coughs> where are you going? If you want a good meal, see Maria at the cafeteria. She'll hook you up. Hey there. Looking for a meal? See Maria. She runs the Sunshine Diner in the atrium. Hey, look. Familiar. Excuse me. Now that you made it in, we'll be keeping an eye on you. So do us all a favor and behave yourself. Well, we can talk about it.
Oh. Okay, that place. This place is big. I like it. Hey, Mr. Reminds... Are you really from the Commonwealth? Yes, I am. I knew it. Hey, I can show you around the vault if you want. Just five caps. Yeah. Sure, but I'm not paying you. Okay, okay. Boy, you're a real cheapskate. We'll start over here. This is the depot. The Combs family run it. Aaron and I are best friends. Her mom and dad fight a lot, so I don't like to go in there when they're around. But if you need something, they're the ones that have it. Good to know, Austin. Thanks. See, I told you I know things. Next stop, the Overseer. I bet you killed a lot of strange things. Ooh, and raiders. I bet you fought raiders too. Uh, quite interesting, though, honestly. The overseer's office is up there. They're busy up there, and they do not like to be bothered. She makes rules, but she's nice. I like her. Hmm. Overseer, huh? I suppose someone needs to be in charge. Well, if you need her, that's where you'll find her. Next stop, the diner. Now we gotta go downstairs. That's where the diner is. Everybody eats there. Sometimes it gets real crowded. The summer sets are nice, though. You'll like them. Oh, actually, I see a lot of people here. And a man kid. Hello, Austin. I see you're showing our guest from the Commonwealth around. Yes, ma'am. This is the Sunshine Diner. Grant says that they'll take all of our hard work and turn it into swill. Mr. and Mrs. Somerset run the diner. They're pretty nice. Mrs. Somerset's pies are the best. Mm -hmm. I'll come here if I get hungry. I like it here. I'll save you a slice of pie, Austin. Next stop, Horatio. I told you they were nice. Do you like your hair? I like mine. I hate combing it, though. Grand makes me comb it. <laughs> Austin, that hair of yours is a mole rat's nest. <laughs> this is where Horatio fixes up people's hair. Aaron's mom comes here all the time. Grand hardly comes here at all. She makes me cut my hair, though. It's not fair. If I ever need a new hairstyle, I'll come here. I hate getting my hair cut. Next stop is Grand. Let's go see Grand. I live with her. She's not my real grandmother, though. My parents died when I was real little. Okay. Now I feel bad for not giving him the caps. Hi, Grand. Austin, what are you doing here? Are you bothering that stranger from the Commonwealth? I'm not bothering him. I'm helping him. Hmm. That's Grand. She takes care of me. You can call her Dr. Penske. She acts all grumpy, but it's not for real. Says you. She runs our hydroponics lab. It's where we get all our food. Good to know. I bet she takes good care of you. When she remembers. Or isn't too busy. Watch it, boy. Next up, <laughs> Miss Kate. Damn, there is more. Shit. Come on, hurry up. We gotta go to the other side of the vault. I'll show you where I go to school. I bet you didn't have to go to school. I did.
Oh my god, this is definitely big. That's what she said. <laughs> Shut up, man. <gasps> no fucking way. This is the school. Miss Katie runs it. It's boring most of the time. But Gran says I have to go anyway. Your Gran is a smart woman, Austin. It's good to know all the kids are getting an education. <laughs> if you say so. Next stop is the medical clinic. Let's go downstairs. I'll show you the clinic. Doc Forsyth and Rachel are okay, I guess. But I don't go there unless I have to. Or unless Grant makes me. Well, I'm just wondering where I will find this robot. Is it Katie? Katie? I forgot the name. Oh, this nice. is our medical clinic. If you get hurt or sick, come down here. Dr. Forsythe says I can't bother him or Rachel while they're working. Did you ever get sick? Just colds and stuff. <coughs> Hardly anyone here gets sick. Mr. Somerset broke his foot once, though. They put a big cast on it, and he had to walk with crutches. Now we go see Erin. She's going to be surprised when she sees you. Come on, this way. Erin and I spend a lot of time together. She didn't believe me when I said I would bring you to her. You're a little slow, my friend. Something's telling me that I'm gonna freaking get lost here. Excuse me. Your pit boy ever act up on you? Mine's been glitchy lately. Yes, little guy. Excuse me. The work never ends in Vault 81. What you said? Yeah. Aaron, look who I found! The stranger from the Commonwealth. Wow. You're really from the Commonwealth? Yes, I am. Whoa, someone from the Commonwealth. That's so cool. We haven't had a visitor in a while now. Thanks for doing my tour. I was so cool to show you off to everyone. Hi, Austin. Grant says I'm a bottomless pit when it comes to food. Well, oh. Gonna close or what? Dr. Penske runs a hydroponics lab here. She may have some work for you if you're interested. Mm. Looking for a robot. Fresh. What would it be? Oh, I saw one out here. Reactor. Jesus, Daddy, can you not do that here? What if he over... Or or whatever you call it? Come with me, Slack, Tina. I've been working 12 hours straight. Oh, you've been working. Sure. I bet bossing around old Rusty really takes it out of you. You've no idea, Mr. Luca. Hey, will you both just get lost? You're killing my buzz here. With pleasure, sir. Fine, get caught. Then you won't have the choice to leave because the Overseer will make it for you. Hey there. Hey, Outsider. Do me a favor. If my good-for-nothing brother asks you for Jet, tell him to buzz off. Alright. Look, he's a junkie, but he's getting careless. If he gets caught, we're both in trouble. And as much as I'd like to leave this canned paradise, that's not how I want to go. Uh... If he's addicted... You should try to help him get clean. I don't think I haven't tried. I locked him in his room for a week. It wasn't two days before he was using again. Now I admit, I've got my own share of the blame here. Bobby gets his chems from me, and I keep him on a short leash. But not anymore. I'm cutting off his useless ass. 
Okay. Good. That's the first step to helping your brother. Should have done it a long time ago. But things ain't easy around here. It was a problem or something like that, but no. Wait, where did it go? It was a freaking... Ah, the robot was here. Damn it. Oh, there it is. Please direct any maintenance requests to Mr. DeLuca. They will be handled in the order they were received. I don't have any requests. Better for the both of us. Unless you like waiting, of course. Mr. DeLuca has good intentions, but let's just say his ability to prioritize is a bit lacking. <coughs> I believe it has something to do with his sobriety. <laughs> Sounds like a typical boss to me. It's a relief to hear you say so. Compared to his predecessor, Mr. DeLuca has very little mechanical knowledge. I almost thought him unqualified. But when it comes to delegation, he's top notch. <laughs> All right, so. <clears throat> what else we can check here? What, what the. If you need something, ask Alexis. I can't make heads or tails of her sort. Hey, hold. So you're the new guy. I heard we let someone into the vault. How long do you plan on sticking around? Uh, long enough to have a good look around. Long enough to have a good look around. Well, hopefully that means not long. We can take care of ourselves here in 81. We don't need to be letting in every stray traveler that comes our way. Welcome, welcome. I hope I'm not being presumptuous, but I'd like to ask you a favor. Would you mind donating some medical samples, even just a blood sample? Um... Sure, you can have some blood. Excellent. Just have a seat, and I'll draw some blood. Okay, sounds good to me. This will only take a sec. Oh shit. There, hardly hurt a bit, eh? Thank you, this will be a great help. Now, I need to get these prepared immediately. Rachel. You're that wanderer from the Commonwealth. I'm Rachel. I assist Dr. Forsyth with his medical duties. Are you sick or injured? No. Oops. Gonna pass. Let me know if that changes. All right. Just a normal wound. Yes. Another one. If you want a good meal. Yeah, I got it. Thank you. We like the Skyrim soldiers. Okay, um. Um, bum, 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 bum. Where am I going now? No, this is the. Uh... Hi. What you looking at? I heard outsiders were dangerous. You really need that many weapons? Uh, yeah. Excuse me. He's looking pretty bad. Can you you talk should stop me? by and see Horatio while you're here. Can't imagine you come across many barbers in the Commonwealth. Yeah, well, thanks, though, now. I like my hair exactly as it is. You're still here? Well, I couldn't find that one then. Um... This is a depot, right? No. What the heck is this place? Uh, 
Okay, I told you, I'm lost. <laughs> I hope you don't have anything that needs fixing. I really don't feel hey. like Our Commonwealth guest, welcome to the depot. And pardon the clutter, I don't get much time to tidy up these days. No time, why not? No time? Why not? Ugh, where to begin? When you're dealing with items that are all over 200 years old, work just accumulates like crazy. Some days it's all I can do to keep my head above water. But you probably don't want to hear about all that. Let me know if you want to take a look. I might be interested in buying or selling. Great. I have all sorts of odds and ends. More like buying than selling. I'm sorry, more than selling than buying. But anyway. You got it. Let's see. A couple of those, huh? 200. Okay, let me check. Let me do 308. And take this one. Tired of these tools giving out on me. Don't they know there's work to be done? All right, let's see. Oh. Goddamn robot is not here again. Feel free to make the most of the services we offer while you're here. Overseer. If you haven't already, you should stop by the classroom. Katie would love to have you speak to her students. Um, dude. Wait, I'm not even half any uh, mission for this place. We got a barber here if you need it. I, not saying you do. Um. Uh, where's that place again? Law and the hybridization. Oh no, this is the empty room. Oh shit. Oh, you got guts wearing that pit bull in your commonwealth. I can't believe someone hasn't tried to steal it yet. Oh, there. Ashes! Well, hello. Excuse me, mister. Have you seen my cat? Ashes gone? Yeah, actually. What happened? He scratched me. And I yelled at him to go away. I didn't mean forever, though. His name is Ashes, and he's the best cat in the whole world. Mm. No. No, I haven't seen your cat. Would you go look for him? His name is Ashes. He's probably scared and lonely. Sure. I'll find him for you. Thank you. His name is Ashes. He's the sweetest little gray cat. I just want him to come home. All right, we got one, finally. <laughs> Not the kind of mission that I will like, but still. Hey, Katie. Oh, you're that new traveler. You must have had so many adventures out in the Commonwealth. Every waking moment's an adventure out there. Oh my, I knew it. My kids would love to hear some of them. Would you be willing to talk to my class? Sure. I'd be glad to talk to them. Marvelous. Stop by whenever class is in session. I'll just stop what I'm doing and turn the class over to you. Show stories. Oh yeah, what time is it? 4.40? So wait, um, talk to Kit. Well, let's talk to her. Hello, Katie. This will be a rare treat for the kids. So I guess we gotta wait or something? Find Ashes. Damn it, she's holding that fridge. Sorry about the maintenance. She felt like my grandma. The 
work oh, never ends in Ball 31. Fuck. Looking for a meal? See Maria. She runs the Sunshine Diner. Alright, let's see what we got. All this just to look for a cat? Damn it. Fuck's sake. Ashes, go home. Aaron misses you. What the freak was that? You move, piece of cat. I think she... What's in here? Terminal's got this locked. Terminal? So she might be here. Hey, sweetie. Ashes! You found him! Thanks, mister. I was so worried about him. You're welcome. I'm so glad he's safe. Ashes! Bad kitty. Oh, fuchsia and core? I was core? so worried about you. And I bet okay. mom's gonna make me give you a bath. Hi there. I wish my mom and dad wouldn't fight so much. I know I don't like it either. All right, we got that. So fucking creepy. I'll be damned if that whole duct isn't gonna need replacing. <sighs> now nah, we got a problem with the class. Supposed to be in the morning then. And I seat my ass You're here. Be a regular around here. And 
I will wait. It's 6 p.m. Let's go 12. Uh, like this. Ah. The outsider returns. Well, not really. One more. Uh, maybe two more. Uh, let's see. Is there any class? Wait, let me just look for it. Uh, let's see what, what's going on with this. Uh, no, actually, I'm gonna leave it that way, uh, facing here. Mm -hmm. So, Curry. There is a mission called hole in the wall oh there we go uh the native uh, blood then pursue the kitty i should wait 24 hours or more but i could me have okay So we, it says upon Sotor returns, Austin Angel will have been. Me. Holy shit, that scared me. Austin Angel will have been moved to the Bolts Medical Bay. Speaking with Dr. Pins, begin the quest. Alright. Where are they? There. You have to do something, Jacob. I'm running the test as fast as I can, Priscilla. I can't treat Dr. Dr. Forsyth. Not now, Bobby. And you, stranger, will have to wait your turn. We have an emergency here. Austin got bitten by a mole rat. Isn't that enough, Jacob? There can't be that many mole rat diseases or toxins. Rachel is examining the mole rat. Hopefully she'll find something. But these aren't ordinary mole rats. Who knows what kind of diseases they are carrying. Because he's just a child, it's affecting him more severely. Dr. Forsythe, please. I think I found something that might help Austin. Bobby! Hold on, Priscilla. What is it, Bobby? Well, you know that door Austin found? He found it because of me. I keep my private things in there. He saw me get them. You mean your chems? Get to the point, Bobby. What did you find in that place? It's like a whole extra vault in there, but half ruined and caved in. There was this terminal there, so I started poking around in it. There were some notes and stuff about using mole rats to grow viruses. But they also said that they used them to make vaccines and treatments. A secret vault. Good lord, I've never heard of such a thing. Bobby, you're a genius. A junkie genius. There might be a cure <laughs> for whatever Austin got from that mole rat somewhere in that place. Excuse me, Dr. Penske. You there. How would you like to do Vault 81 a favor and possibly save my boy's life? Yep. I would be glad to help. I was hoping I could count on you. Bobby here will show you where he keeps his secret stash. There is a chance that somewhere in there is a cure for Austin. If you find it, bring it to Dr. Forsythe. And for Austin's sake, please hurry. Follow me. taking so long you the fuck okay 
That is interesting. All right, let's see. Oh, is there mole rats? It's gonna be really bothering. Some water. Oh, I went into the pit one and I forgot to sell those documents, but okay, I'll find more, I guess. So wait, it says just find the cure, okay. Thanks for the opportunity, though. One more. There's definitely not here. Stick. Oh my god. Wait.
Aha. Okay, more XP. See. Just in case. I'm detected. Well, what? down below. They're so fucking annoying. overblown and Austin will be running around tomorrow. Overblown or not, we have to do what we can for Austin. I just don't know what I can do. Neither do I, Priscilla. Why him? He's just a boy. He's going to be just fine. You'll see. Oh, what? Joy for you. You get to nag me and I can't go anywhere. Oh, real nice, Holt. Make this about you. Don't you think about anyone other than yourself? Your daughter could get sick like Austin, and you're whining about spending time with your family? I have things to do. We don't have to hide away in here. You're so busy, Holt. You have so much to do. Please, explain to Aaron why your needs are more important than her safety. Just never mind. Now. 
find them. Fuck's sake. Oh, there we go. One more. Still kicking, huh? You will not tell me that this. Coming here all the time, just like this. like a mascot treatment sort kind of Three, great. I right, wait. There too. Uh, 
Oh, how do I get the other one? Oh, interesting. Any wire and the great up button. Oh, okay, gotcha. like this. Oh, shit. Okay, sorry. Oh, another stranger. Are you Vault Tech Security? I've waited so very patiently for you to arrive. Uh... Yes, you guess I am. Superb! I placed an emergency call so long ago. I was beginning to think something dreadful must have happened. I am pleased to report I completed my primary duties 83 years ago. Thousands <laughs> of pathogens were grown in the mole rat hosts. Then a single broad spectrum cure was developed to treat them all. Very satisfying work for many decades. Now, please tell me you are authorized to release me from the lab. Okay. Uh, I am so authorized. You are released. Super. <laughs> I had almost given up all hope of leaving here. I'll open the door for you. Since you are a Volt Tech representative, I entrust you with the broad spectrum cure I developed. If you have an equivalent to my digital Hippocratic Oath, please use it quickly to prevent any undue suffering. However, be advised, there is only one dose left, and I can no longer make any more. If that is all, I am most eager to leave. Why, uh, why more? Only one? You only have one dose? That is correct. There used to be more, but they all expired. Sadly, oh. the organic compounds necessary to make more have all deteriorated. Thanks for the cure. It is my hope that this cure finds its way to someone who needs it. Hopefully now I can properly further my scientific research. Since my job here is done, I think I will follow you out. Yes? Uh, are you coming, Frank? Oh, perfect. Uh-oh. Oh, crack. There we go. Oh no. Thanks, I don't have intention to stay. Oh, this is the one, okay. Oh. It is good not to be stuck in the quarantine. Let's go, babe.
Okay, this is the one that I couldn't open from the other side. Dr. Forsyth and Rachel have plenty of medical supplies to get you stocked up. It is stimulating traveling with you. Alright, let's go. I think she's going to be my follower for a long time. If I have a chance, of course. Whoa. Good work on the cat retrieval. I thought for sure Ash was gone. I heard one of the kids got bit by some sort of mutant rat. The cure. You found it. Here, take the cure and use it on the boy. Only one dose? I hope this works. If it doesn't, there won't be anything to analyze to try again. Let's hope this works. I heard you had returned. It's gonna be magic. Magic. And on your ass. It shouldn't be long. This way, three, two, what? one. Where, where am I? You're Thank in God. the clinic. You were really sick, Austin. Our visitor from the Commonwealth saved your life. Really? Gee, thanks, mister. I was worried to death about you, Austin. What got into your fool head? Going into a place like that. Nothing exciting ever happens here. I just wanted to see what was in there. Well, if it hadn't been for a friend here, you might have died. Thank you. I know you made sacrifices to help him. I no. know Dr. Pinsky will be grateful. For my part, I'd like to give you the surrender. I had it for years and never really had a use for it. She's not oh. the only one. The whole vault is thankful. I'd like to give you a room here in the vault. A place you can call your own. It's in the main hall. On the left. Excuse me, overseer. I hope you enjoy your accommodations. I wanted to say thank you again for what you did for Austin. You've opened a lot of eyes around here, including my own. I had no idea of the dangerous vault tech had hidden away so close to home. I can't believe so many died just behind our walls. Uh, well, yeah. Whatever vault -Tec had planned, it failed and took their entire staff out with it. No arguments here. I hate to think of what they had planned for us. But on the good side, you made a real impression on our anti-Commonwealth people. They're realizing outsiders really can be trusted and do more good than just providing resources. You'll always be welcome here. And I hope you make a habit of visiting. Having a trusted outsider would help serve as a reminder that the Commonwealth isn't something to fear and avoid. Uh, actually, I'll be agreed to avoid. <laughs> yeah, definitely. A moment, please. I have been trapped so many years. I believe it's customary to thank you for your role in saving me. My entire life has been in this vault. I have analyzed and learned everything there is to know here. So now I must see the rest of the Commonwealth. Consult with scientists, unearth more data to challenge my hypothesis. Um. After the bombs, the Commonwealth is a little lacking in the science department. But surely there is still men of learning out there, and if nothing else, there is data. Please, monsieur, can you take me with you? Come along, Come along then. Excellent. We must embark at once. Whee! <laughs> Alright, I got him. Oh yeah, I wanted to... Oh, but I don't remember the name. Talking about backpacks, I wanna see that. Is 
it, is it this one? Personal log entry 142. I can sum up living on the Pridwin in four words. No. I miss field assignments. Don't get me wrong, the research we're doing is exciting stuff. But life on this ship is a nightmare. I'm trapped in this metal tube 18 hours a day. I still can't decide who smells worse, the soldiers or the mole rats. And what passes for conversation among the grunts makes mutants seem scholarly. I'm gonna speak to Proctor Quinlan. Field scribes cannot have it this bad. <laughs> oh, that's it. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> we got one more. Uh, can I like... Oh, I remember. It's just 25, so uh, the idea was to save one for this and one for this. 24th and 25th. Stop. Okay, on that case, I will use my next one on... this one I don't know if I can sneak with this robot but I'll try anyway now we have this mission here and we have uh, oh, this is reactor um, yeah. sanctuary Hey, what is it? Um, talk to cat, please. Abbott. Seeds. I need more seeds. <laughs> now, where will be? Katie. I can't wait to see how excited the kids will be. Shit. Okay, here. So let's go to 10, 12, 12 a.m. I'm sorry, 12 hours. about what you did for our little Austin. Don't know many who could do the same. Hi, how are you? I'm good. So let's wait one hour. You guys. Perfect. Hello, Katie. Would you like to tell the students one of your stories now? Sure. I'd be glad to. Wonderful. The kids are so excited. <laughs> children! Children, listen up. We have a guest today who is going to tell us stories about the Commonwealth. Did you ever fight a Deathclaw? Oh. Uh, Death claws are very dangerous. It was a tough fight. How did you beat it? I was shot up pretty bad by the raiders that had my friend Preston trapped. But you were still able to rescue him, right? Hmm. 
Show me where to find some power armor. Preston showed me where to find some power armor I could fix. Power armor! Wow. I wasn't ready <laughs> when the death claw crawled out. Good thing I had that power armor. That sounds scary. Preston and I kept shooting until it was dead. I bet that took lots of bullets. Thank you so much for that story. <laughs> Children, say thank you. Thank, thank you. you. And we have a thank you gift for you. Here. Good. Critical hits with an arm amulet attacks per minute to five damage. Well, it was kind of weird, but I like it. Short stories. And now we have a Curie. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. If you want a good meal, Maria at the cafeteria. She'll hook you up. I just want to get out, honestly.
Um, there is something that I need to save here. This one. And we're gonna save this and this coat. I'm gonna create something really big here one of these days. Maybe tonight if I have the chance. And um, a little bit. So you, Kiri, will help me later. Now, I need to check the caravan. What is this? Retrieve the. Ah. Mary, uh, explore the museum. This is the caravan, this is stress call. This is the one. An emergency broadcast. Our caravan's under attack by hostile robots and needs some serious help. We're just east of Watts Consumer Electronics. If anyone in the vicinity can come help, now's the time. Ada, loop this message. Yes, sir. So, there, Shark Memorial Bridge. This is not absolutely long, but... Yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake. I can't see it. Ooh, this will be tough. <laughs> you should wash your hands after that. It will be unsanitary to handle the deceased. It's a short part. Technical manual. Take everything that I think that I will need, you know, like. survive the attack. Thank you for assisting. I was certain to meet my end here as well. Are you okay? Physically, the damage is minor, but I am registering sadness and anger at the loss of my friends. It may sound strange coming from a robot, but they were my family. 
Again, I thank you for your efforts. I know they would have thanked you as well. I'm sorry for your loss. My name is Ada. This was the third time we've been attacked by robots like these. Even with the weapon and detection upgrades Jackson gave me, I was unable to defend them. Tell me about these robots. They roam the Commonwealth and claim to be restoring order. We've seen them fighting raiders, but they've also attacked innocents, settlers, merchants, and caravans like ours. We knew we ran the risk of encountering more of these hostile robots if we stayed in the Commonwealth. If only we had made the decision to leave. You couldn't have known something like this would happen. The probability of attack was high. I should have forced our departure. In recompense, I will seek justice for my friends and stop these robots from causing further harm. It's time to uncover the source and confront their leader, the Mechanist. Oh. You'll need help if you want to succeed. I'm aware of this. You have shown willingness to aid others. I ask that you please assist me in stopping this Mechanist. In return, sure I can will. give you the schematics to build your own robot workbench, so you have additional resources in this undertaking. Ha! <laughs> you want revenge, don't you? I admit my goal is twofold. Stopping the Mechanist both protects the Commonwealth and allows me to avenge my fallen friends. I won't rest until I see this threat dissolved. I owe it to them. Now, we last saw a group of the Mechanist robots at the General Atomics factory. You may find information there that will lead us to the Mechanist. I will follow and assist with your permission. Yeah, let's go ahead. Yeah, let's go, Ada. General Atomics has valuable salvage. Chances are high the robots are still there. Okay, let's send these other robot tools back to Glyland. And uh, I'm gonna save here. And I'm gonna take a break because I need to make lunch. So, in a couple hours, I'll be back here with yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Has been a pleasure.